Okay, so, next part. Um, now, because of my reputation, I've been very, I don't know, um, if I want to take pictures of me and my friends being goofy or something, you know, I can't, um, maybe posting things or dressing a certain way. There's just a lot that I've been confined to based off of my reputation for, you know, speaking about HIV. And I do enjoy speaking, but I just don't want it to have such a control over me. And it really does. Um, I'm not able to do a lot of things that the other kids are able to do, you know. Parties, bunches of YouTube videos, tweeting Facebook, because what happens is that people look for me and then they find all these things and it's just me being me, me being a teenager overall. And um, then these people will tend to try to give you a bad reputation. And I don't consider that, I don't consider that too much of being fair. So um, basically at the end of this video, I do what I like. Because I want to be able to do what I like. I want to be able to post whatever I want on Facebook or YouTube, you know? There's just so much that I get confined to that I really, I don't like. If I want to get a piercing or a tattoo, let me do it. I don't want to have to worry about, oh, well, they might never want me to speak again. I'm pretty much almost ready to call it, um, call it quits on the whole speaking thing. Because it's just become a really huge confinement on me. And I've never been able to do things that other kids are able to do because of my reputation. And I don't like that. So, hopefully senior year, um, I'm going to be in hair and makeup, doing my eyebrows, trying to get my nails done. <laughs> you know, a lot of things. Um... Certainly a few more piercings, like a nose, this, and I'm getting these done when I'm 18 now, but yeah, so basically that's it, <clears throat> um, and then tattoos, but you know, that's when I'm 18, but um, just having family that, you know, are like, oh, well, People wouldn't like you for this, or they wouldn't like you. And I'm sitting here saying, hey, I can hide it this way and this way. What are you talking about? And they're still rejecting it. Um, I don't too much like that. I really don't. Because I want to get to a person when I see Tasha. She was like, oh, Brianna, I'm trying to get you speaking gigs, and you're making that really difficult. I'm like, how am I making it difficult? Who's going to see it? Like, really, who's going to see it? You have one. She's like, well, you and I are two. No. No. It's it's nothing else. So, I mean, for the most part, if she asks me, well, where do you even want to speak? And I'm, I'm just going to straight up and even tell people, you know, next year when I go to university teens that, you know, I'm about to sit here and call quits. Because it's too much restriction. It really is. There's so much I want to do. So much I want to be able to express about myself. And having the confinements of other people on me is just horrible. So yeah, wait for the last part. <laughs>